Well, Composting is a very special company. We see ourselves as partners in the community to work towards sustainability. So we're working together to make sure that we're minimizing materials that we're sending to the landfill and putting good usable materials out into the environment. We take food scraps and the yard waste and the things that are collected at the curb and turn it into this beautiful compost that Cedar Grove is proud of and that a lot of people in our community use to grow great plants and gardens. Okay, you guys ready to take a walk? So Katie and Michelle will lead the walk outside. We give a monthly tour here and that came out of a demand for people that really wanted to come see the plant. So we bring people in to show how we do composting here at Cedar Grove, uh, not just from our own community, uh, but they come from all over the world. So the material that you see here comes from thousands of yards where people have trimmed their bushes. We have Christmas trees, we have pumpkins in October and November. This comes from stadiums, corporate campuses, offices, food service courts of malls. It's coming in from churches and schools and the material that comes in here is from all around Seattle from the individual level to the major baseball game level. We are here at the Everett facility. It's one of two facilities that Cedar Grove Composting operates here in the Puget Sound region. This is our newest facility built in 2004, utilizing the highest level of technology available for the type of feedstocks that we take. In fact, this facility is the largest of this type of facility in the world. And we get people from all over the world that come here to see how urban composting is done using this technology. and it goes to that grinder right over there and it chops it all up. And from the grinder, it goes on a conveyor system. It writes the conveyor system. And then this huge magnet comes and pulls all the metal out to make sure that it stays out of the compost as it rides its way through the process. And in that metal pile, we find all kinds of stuff. Nails, spoons, trowels. We find metal ties, all sorts of things. Even rebar comes out of the yard bin sometimes. We were the first composter in the U.S. to bag compost. We were one of the first uh, companies to bring in the technology that you see here today. The whole cycle and, and focus of our business is sustainability, and we're proud that we're a company that provides green jobs before they were even, even trendy to talk about, and also we're a great employer and a great service to the community. You see there's a lot of trucks coming and going here and they're bringing in materials that other people may think of as garbage that we just diverted over here to Cedar Grove, but it's not that. Those are valuable resources for us that we call feedstock. And we use that feedstock to create very nice usable material that won't be wasted in a landfill, won't create methane gas as it would in a landfill, but will come here instead to create compost which helps um, actually minimize our carbon footprint. So this is about all of us and our ability to engage in a model of sustainability that helps our community and helps you continue to, to be a better steward of the environment. This is what I love to show people. Oh, see the microbes, woo! This is the beautiful stuff we make. Isn't it beautiful? Made out of the food waste and yard waste. Isn't it great? Nice and rich and dark. We know that Cedar Grove products are the best available out there and there's a variety of ways you can get them. You can get them by the bag in your local garden centers. You can get them in bulk, come, come in with your truck on a weekend or during the day and get a load in your truck. Or you can go to a variety of dealers in your neighborhood that carry it both in bulk and in bags. And once you use Cedar Grove in your yard and garden and you, get, and you try the product out, you're gonna see a difference in your plants, you're gonna see a difference in the color of your plants, the size of your plants, 
the yield in your vegetable gardens. And that's really what we're talking about because when we can bring all that together and the end of the story is we get to grow great plants, great food, great herbs, great flowers, and those clippings go back in the yard bin, that's the story. We've created a whole sustainability loop and as a sustainable business, we count on you to help us continue to create that sustainability.